Hey everyone, what's up? This is Simon from DevDectic. Today I will show you how to create an easy image gallery using Ionic 2. But first of all, we need to install a little package which will help us to actually zoom into an image. So we got this Ionic, um, this package on GitHub. It's from this guy called Ryron. So thanks Ryron. And we can go ahead and install it simply into our app. So I've already created a blank new Ionic app and I've also added uh, four images to our assets image folder so we can display those image inside our gallery. Now we need to make two little changes to our app module file. So first of all we have to import the Ionic image viewer module Ah, exactly. And we need to import it up here to load the npm package. Now let's go to our home page. So you can see currently the page is empty. There's not really anything going on. So for now, we add an array to our home page consisting of the four images inside our assets folder. So we could even make it more easy, but for now, this should work. All right. And number two. Okay, so we got our image array, which we can now use inside our view. First of all, um, we're going to use the ion slides component, which works pretty good, but is actually not exactly how we want our image gallery to look. You will see. So I will already give it a class because we need to uh, add some stuff. Uh, maybe we leave it uh, to the blank version for now. So inside the slides we got the ion slide and the ng4 which will go over the array of our images. Now finally inside the slide we got the actual image uh, and the path is assets, img and then following the name of our image. This will later also get a class. For now I will keep it like this so you see uh, what's actually going on. Maybe I can even uh, move it side by side. Uh, wait a second, okay. We don't need this, I think. So currently you can see we got the image sliding and it's full screen. And it also uh, stops at the end. So there are a few things we can change. First of all, we can set loop equals true. So now if we hit the end of our array or the beginning, we simply start at the end again, so it's like an infinite gallery now. Also, we can add, um, or maybe I can show you something quite cool. Um, I inspected the component and found out that you could even uh, add something like a cover flow. Um, you can see. Uh, it's of course not perfect right here and with a shadow up there. But it's quite interesting how easy you could add something like this. So we go uh, with slides per view. And we set our slides per view to 2. Um, so this will give us a different image, you see. Now we got actually two images inside one slide. But still we cannot see a preview of the following. So now it's time to get into our CSS and tweak it a little bit around. So um, we also want to have some padding right there. Uh, sorry. So every image should have some padding at least. But anyway, still we're not uh, where we want it to be. And now we add the ion slide, swiper slide, and directly 
modify the CSS for this and we move it some percentage away from the left um, which works pretty good I think right so the component still thinks it has to display two images inside but they are moved a bit so everything fits quite good now um, initially I also had width inside here but I think it's um, not even needed anymore no we can just achieve it by using this simple trick and yeah it should work all right so this is the first part of creating an image gallery now to get a little zooming image view the only thing we have to add now is image viewer and now the problem is um, it will come up but I can actually not uh, zoom inside this view so now you would have to deploy it to a simulator but anyway you can already see that the view is coming up just as we want it to be and if you slide down you even get this native like animation um, so you can slide it to the bottom and uh, it will disappear again. So try around on your device, it works even better than inside the browser. And that's already all to create a simple image gallery using Ionic and a very cool image viewer package. So hopefully um, this will be inside Ion Scroll very soon, but for now I think this is a very good solution. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you want more in-depth training, also make sure to check out the Ionic Academy. And we will see us again next time inside the DevDactic channel or the Academy forum. So stay tuned and goodbye.